Uh, here with Andrew Sumner, the Eureka Senior at the uh, 2013 Festus Tiger Town Invitational, and um, um, after a uh, helping helping the uh, Eureka Wildcats to run up, finish the state cross, and earning all state honors, um, pretty good start to your to your track season. Tell me, um, came away with a runner up finish, uh, close uh, 1600 in what 510? Is that right? Yeah. And then. Uh, return to the track and even colder and windier conditions for an 800 victory and what 222 223 it was 222 okay um what, what did you think tell me about those races um yeah the 1600 went pretty well we like i think i started out too fast but um so i kind of struggled with the last lap but yeah, it looks like you guys came through right about what 70. Yeah. So it was like the same t- time I came in at the 229, 230, but, I think, for yeah. half, 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 halfway. Yeah, so I kind of suffered on the last lap, but um, I was happy with my time. And yeah. The 800, um, it was, I think we started out a little slower, and then I picked it in at the 300. Yeah, you really pulled away from the rest of the field big time that last, you know, last 250 or 300 meters. Yeah. Um, what... What uh, are, are you happy with those times? And are you any you want to feel comfortable? Shoot, are any goals? Are you, I'm sure the big that big five minute sub five minute goal is, is yeah. probably a, a big goal for most most uh, good high school runners. Yeah, definitely. I wanted to break five ten really, and then um, I really want to break the five minutes the eventually. Yeah. yeah, and then um, I wanted to break two twenty in the eight hundred okay. today. So. Next time. Yeah, yeah, not great conditions today. It started out like it was going to be great conditions, and then yeah. it quickly got cold and and, uh, and a little windy. But um, and uh, goals for team wise, you guys have been uh, close to a trophy, I know, and uh, obviously we're runner up and cross, and uh, and I think just missed the trophy at state last year in track. Yeah. Yes. And uh, is that the big goal this year? Is to try to stay healthy and everybody running fast and. And get to state and, and try to bring home another trophy. Yeah, definitely. Like we lost two of our girls, so um, it looks like we're gonna have a couple of good ones to come in. So okay, we can get to that. Another another strong four by eight squad, I'm sure, for the Eureka Lady Wildcats. Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, and then uh, tell me about college. You said you, you're you're gonna run next year at Semo. Yeah. What was that process like? Was that fun or uh, anxiety filled? What, are you glad yeah. to have that over? It was kind of stressful, but um, I'm glad I finally can like have that over and like be just focused on track. Yeah, so. yeah. Are you excited about looking forward and in, in, in running in college? Yeah, definitely. Okay. Well, I know the uh, uh, Simo's got a lot, of, a, lot of, a lot of the team comes from St. Louis and yeah. uh, um, definitely seem like they're making big strides. Mm-hmm. And uh, um, Tell me what what it's like uh, having uh, obviously some great tradition and excellence at, at Eureka for a long time, but tell me a little bit about your about your amazing teammate and Hannah Long and what it's been like uh, for her to come in and run with her for a couple of years. And surely it's had to be a little frustrating for you know coming as freshman and just be amazing and faster than everybody else. What was that like initially? Yeah, it was like definitely a change to like have someone that could come on our team, but like. I think we all benefit from it because it's like, you know, like she's like the best. So like, it's like we can base off our training on her and like really helps me in practice. Pushes everybody else's yeah. expectations up. Yeah. yeah. So, well, any, uh, any, uh, even though she was she's so talented, even last year as a freshman or even this year as a sophomore, any still make her sit at the back of the bus or carry bags or uh, any any anything like that to. Uh, bring her into the program yeah well i guess that was more like a freshman thing yeah like carry like our waters and stuff oh, okay she did it she did it uh, happily she was she, yeah. she didn't didn't wasn't too upset with it yeah she doesn't complain yeah, yeah. well i mean you guys had uh, just a great cross team and actually you know lots of several you know uh, you know four of the best runners in this on the team in the state this year and um um, you know, it'll be fun to watch you guys throughout the season. Hopefully stay healthy and hopefully have a lot of great college careers for a lot of the uh, Eureka ladies in the yeah. future, too. So, Well, what's next on the schedule for you? Uh, 
Um, I think it's Henley Homes. Okay. Parkway Central and next is that next Thursday and Friday, I guess. Yeah. Okay. And then um, are you guys headed to KU for the Kansas yeah. Relays? Is that We're a going to that? Okay. Um, well, hopefully the weather will be nice and uh, we hopefully stay stay healthy and uh, break that five minute uh, yeah. barrier. Well, thanks for the time. Congratulations. Keep right. it up. Thank you. All right.